Hamburg won't be my first marathon, but due to different circumstances, I have never run a classic city race. I did races with multiple laps, and sometimes there were almost no people at the course. So now, I'm really looking forward to run a big race in a large city. Standing on the start line with thousands of athletes, seeing and hearing the crowds cheering on me. But it's not only about having fun, it's also about qualifying for the Olympic Games in Paris next year. And therefore, I have to beat my PB in Hamburg. So there is still some way to go. I have been uh, started training camp a month ago, already 10 years ago. Um, so every year we were here from January to two weeks long with my uh, first training group um, because uh, it was in the holidays. So there was also uh, kids uh, in our group. They were in school or some studied in the university or like me, I worked part-time at that time and don't have to take a lot of holidays uh, for this training camp. And yeah, and I enjoyed it. So, but now it's already three years ago. I was the last time here because of the COVID times. Um, and yeah, now I, I know what I missed the last years. Um, yeah, because it's such a, it's a nice place uh, to run. Yeah, today I have a really nice workout. I'm looking forward to the last weeks. Um, first, we do the normal uh, warm-up, 4K. Um, we do a little bit of stretching, some strides, and then we start first a little bit easy. Um, it's first a 3K in 315 pace. It's just uh, to have a little bit more mileage um, in the whole uh, training. And then we start with the real workout. It is a three times 5K, and we started also yeah a little bit faster than the first 3K, but it's already three minutes pace. And then I, I guess my coach will take like that, and then he decided how fast I go the next uh, 5K. Normally it's planned to 55 pace, and the last one in 250 pace. So it's much faster than uh, the marathon pace. It's more uh, half marathon pace um, because I train being here for the half marathon in Barcelona on the 19th of February. Um, so that's a very important uh, workout two weeks before the race. Um, and then, yeah, I I think I'm ready uh, to yeah run a new uh, PB. Yeah, after the warm up, I will just do some stretch my legs, my upper body and some easy exercises, a little bit of drills, some strides and then we're going for the first easy run 3k before the workout started. So warm up is done and now we're going out here on the nice road straight for the workout. The idea of the training today, it is a real uh, first hard workout. Uh, let's say uh, a little bit um, uh, training tempo for the half marathon is doing in, in two weeks from now. And it's the first also uh, harder and, and, and bigger training. 
And we uh, want to also to create fatigue today to, uh, to really push on, uh, on the aerobic power uh, of Ritchie and also combine it with a, a long run that we will do um, the next day. And that will be, uh, let's say, a good uh, first block from, from marathon training in, uh, in two days. Now the first rep begins with the 5k. Let's do. Okay. was uh, 15 flat, 1.8 lactate, so now we can go 10 seconds. Second one was 14.32, so a bit faster than we wanted, but still okay. Now it's getting hard. The last one. No lactate needed. What? No lactate needed. What do you mean? No, no, 3.5. It could be also four. Or ah, no, no, no. It can be even. Uh, hopefully, maybe five or six. Okay. That, that would be really good on this uh, volume. Okay, we have 10 seconds. Yeah. Come on, Richie. Third one, not getting hot. Can you take this? Yeah. Okay, let's go. Yeah. Go. Come on, Richie. Push, push, push! 
After 2k, really hard already. Yeah. <laughs> I have 22, 23. You? I have 21. Three point like that, and third one 1420. Ah, first hard workout after the Europeans. <laughs> uh, really new feeling for me in my body. <laughs> Yeah, it's nice. It was, uh, the last 2k, I think it was uh, <laughs> game over, but he started push uh, keep it pushing, so it was good. The first k was uh, 250. Yeah, 250, 254. And then 254. I think 252, 250. Oh, but that's that's what we know with you. 
But uh, how do you say it? That's why you're also so good in the marathon because you, yeah, you, you're, uh, how do you say it? Your, uh, your um, uh, aerobic and your anaerobic uh, threshold they are really close to each other. Yeah, that's true. And also, we are. Uh, I didn't see you, but we are I think, nine days. Yeah, nine days be uh, behind Bacala. Yeah, normally I fell always in a hole. Oh, well, but that's why I mean, why it's so good. Yeah. So yeah, no. All right. If you see now uh, in two weeks, uh, if you're much fresher, the yeah, altitude also cool. starts working, and you felt a little bit even uh, the pain from Monaco again. I'm curious. What you think. But I think you never did something like this with me, so. Mm -hmm. We did the 10k, the 10, the 10k. We did the two times 10k. Yeah, uh, but, but uh, yeah, yeah. I watched the yesterday. It was supposed to be the 30, 30 or 30, 40, 30, 30, something yeah. like that with so 1k yeah, rest. Yeah, uh, no, 30, yeah, 3043 and 3035 yeah, or something like that. Yeah, I think if you have to do this today, you know, it's much easier. Because that's what I say. Yeah, 3 minute, three minute pace, pace yeah. it's easy. Yeah, uh, that's it. Pace, it starts. Yeah, because we n never did only last week the yeah, 400. So now I'm finished. Um, for me, the workout was special. Uh, it was a really fast one. So for me, so very tough, of course, because I never did it before. But I'm really satisfied and looking forward to the coming races. Um, also, you have to take in mind that the high altitude uh, camp where I stay in the house is just nine days uh, away. So that's the reason normally it goes a little bit down from the feeling. But in the coming weeks, it will be really good. So I'm really satisfied myself. Now it's time for cool down, so it's also 4K, like the warm up. And then I'm looking forward to the massage, to go to the physio uh, and sleep well. And I'm looking forward also to go to more sessions, the 20K, uh, 26K um, with the guys. It's much easier than when you do it alone with your coach when he always pushes you and no one else is there. So tomorrow will be much easier. Thank you for watching.